Brian got one of these and tried to hatch it over two days ago. Oh, this is so creepy. It's just so creepy, dude. <laughs> What's going on guys? Welcome to my channel, eh kid? My name is Matthias and we're about to look at 10 Toys R Us products. And if they're good, we're going to enjoy them. And if they're bad, we're going to destroy them. Do what must be done. Before we begin though, make sure you click that bell icon to get notified of my videos because you're gonna wanna be notified. Am I right? So you don't miss anything because I comment back for the first 30 minutes. Sometimes I go live and you're gonna know by clicking that bell icon. So Click it so you don't miss it. Remote controlled anglefish, blue. So it's just like a, a little remote controlled toy, right? You can control where your ant aquabot fish swims with a hex bug aquabot remote control anglefish in blue. That was a mouthful, dude, no joke. Okay, so here are some product highlights. Cute blue color and design. That's a great highlight, dude. With life life markings. Oh my gosh, it looks alive. <laughs> Steer your fish up, down and around obstacles. Up, down and around? Now I'm impressed. I'm impressed if I, if I can actually have depth control. That's pretty cool. Well, let's test it out. Add the cart. Smart fish technology. What's a smart fish, dude? Smart fish technology. Oh, sweet, they use the smart fish tech. Gotta love it when they use the smart fish tech, dude. I'm afraid to like yank it out of here but I did anyways. Surprisingly, these fins down here do not move. I assume it rotates like this. So this thing rotates up and down, so it will flap to maybe steer it. Let's find out if that is correct. This remote is tiny, dude. Does it know it needs to be in water? And we drop it in. Oh yeah, it needs to be in water. What? Once you get going, you could then steer it, but we don't have enough, like, See, I can steer left now. No, nope. I literally can't go right. Can't go right. I can go left, watch. Woo! But if I wanna go right, I, I just really can't. See, here are the controls. You get speeding up, boom, and then you steer, right? And when you steer, it does this, or this. As you can see, going left is much more dramatic than going right. However, like, I don't have much control over the over depth on this. It's either speed or steering. Yeah, no, see, he goes down. So, the faster I go, his fins are shaped in a way that it's gonna go down. So if I, but there's air inside of it, so when I release, he'll just naturally float back up. That's how you control the depth. This isn't like a big enough bowl to really test, but if I let it do that, it kind of stays down there really disappointed about is the fact that it's like you can't even steer left and right it's like really difficult to like go right it just doesn't do it it goes left it just doesn't go right so that's somewhat disappointing <sighs> you know what that means it's a destroy it fishy go bye bye you think i can hit this first try probably not. i've literally never missed i you don't want to wear a full face mask yeah i do Ow! all right you guys ready so much for smart fish tech eh. Eh. Ha 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 You didn't do anything to the fish. What? There. I did something to that. A little corner. Okay, I did I did not miss. I still hold that I still hold that uh, title of never miss never miss Matt. Oh You still missed the fish! <laughs> I still missed the fish. <laughs> Ooh. Oh my gosh, dude. Are you kidding me right now? Look at this. And it's back. <laughs> I don't yeah, understand. That fish is schooling you. How this fish still exists? Fish! Oh! What the heck? Dude, you're missing it. No, I, how am I missing it? It's shot across the room. You're missing it. You're barely nicking it. Thank you, ah, dude. Ah, ah. Thank you, dude. That fish is resilient, dude. Maybe that's an enjoy it after all. <laughs> what is this? 40? Oh, jeez, relax. The rocket fishing rod is the super fun and easy way for kids to catch fish. Real fish? If you've ever taken your oh. kids fishing, you know how hard it is for them to cast with an ordinary fish. Oh. <laughs> Come on, dude. Just teach your kid how to fish. <laughs> you just cock it and shoot it. 
Everything's gotta be a game these days. I mean, whose fault is that? That's kinda our fault. <laughs> Literally, that's what we do for a job, is make games. Rocket fishing rod! How much could there be about this rocket fishing rod? It's a real fishing rod that catches real fish. I mean, it's not a bad idea. I don't know why they don't do that normally. I mean, I guess it's because there's no, like, rod there. Like, it's just, like, this big. So it's like, yeah. you know, let's see how far it goes. Order now. Oh, it's here! It's the rocket rod! The rocket fishing rod! Catch real fish! It's actually kind of big, no, no joke. Were those just giant kids? Cause it looks small in their hands. Or am I just tiny? Okay, let's see what this is about, dude. Oh, where's the where's the, the thing? Hook? Oh, the hook, dude. I don't want to put on like a hook right now. Okay. Good. There's no hook right now. Where's the? Where? How do I reel it Here. in? Stop, dude. It's broken. No. Yeah. That is like a broken bolt. The idea was that this goes into this and then screws on. You see? Look. I told you. Look. What? It's broken off inside of there. You see that? <laughs> this is stuck inside of there. This went like that, and then you you did this to reel it in. I mean, I can still use it, but it literally broke before I opened it. Uh, what should I shoot at? How about my chair? Ooh. Oh, jeez, that actually shoots hard, dude. <laughs> reel it in. <laughs> I'm reeling it. Oh my gosh, it's taking forever. Oh, and it broke. Again. It's broken, dude. This is garbagio. Dude, I say we return this. This may hurt. Hopefully. Why are you holding it like a bazooka? Because <laughs> it feels much more like a bazooka than a fishing rod. Does that hurt? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, this is to destroy it because it came broken. But because it came broken, I'm obligated for a refund. So I say refund. So we destroyed it or refunding it? Refund, dude. Refund. Next product, guys, this is a like to buy. Which means, if you're new to this channel, I ask you guys, is this a product that you guys would like to see us make a video out of? A dope or nope video where I test it out, I show it to my crew, and we have many challenges. Is this one of those products? It's a Razor Power Rider Drifter. So literally, if I can just show you a quick video here, but I believe this, this thing allows you to drift, dude. It's like electric. Oh, that, I mean, that looks fun, dude. No, this sounds like flamenco music. That looks fun, dude. That does look super fun. Look, this guy knows how to drift, too. Woo! That's awesome. I want to see if this works for adults. Give this video a like. If we heat... If we... <laughs> <laughs> if we heat about 80,000 likes, that would let me know that you guys will want to see this in a solo video. But if it doesn't hit 80k likes, then I'll know that you're not interested. And that's kind of how we gauge interest. So, this one's on hold. Next product. Why do you keep trying to get me in my underwear, Brian? The Amazing Spider-Man Original Underoos. Underwear that's fun to wear. Underwear that's fun to wear. It's fun to wear. Why don't they just call it Thunderwear instead of Underoos? Boys underwear set. This is just creepy now. <laughs> it's just creepy now, dude. You got me. You got me looking at boys' underwear. <laughs> Why, Brian? You don't have to take Why, it out, dude. Why? I don't feel right about this, guys. What is my life, dude? What is my life? I'm just gonna say. <laughs> this isn't even men's, dude. This is literally boys. That's the boys. biggest size I can find. Yeah, because it's not meant for men. I'm a man, right? What do you say? I go to Toys R Us. They don't sell men's toys. That's Best Buy. Yes. <laughs> oh. We should do a Best Buy video, that guys. That might be a little expensive, though. It'd be dope, though. It'd be dope. I'm just gonna have to pass. No enjoy, no destroy. Yeah. I'm just gonna pass. Sure. <laughs> just wants me to try boys on the way. getting creeped out? I'm just... I don't, I'm just getting creeped out, dude. Stop, dude. <laughs> Hatch and grow dino. Ginormous. Ooh, four different dinos. Watch your dino hatch. Place the ginormous hatch and grow dino in a large container of cool water. Uh, during this time, the ginormous hatch and grow dino, do you have to call it that every time? The dino will break out of its shell and begin to grow. Oh, it's like hard plastic, dude. That's like no joke. Here's what we did. Brian got one of these and tried to hatch it when? Yesterday? Over two days ago. Over two days ago. Oh, this is so creepy. 
It's just so creepy, dude. <laughs> it literally broke out the front. It's just so touch weird, it. dude. Why are you afraid to touch it? Because you're gonna, fr you're gonna be like, ah! stop, dude. I was like, you know what? That's a good idea. <laughs> Look, dude. Ew. Ew, dude. Ew. I'm birthing this dino. Oh, it's just weird. Oh my gosh, dude. It's like stuck in there, dude. Yeah, electronics here, bro. Shh. Snake. It's literally stuck. It's glued. What kind of mama glues their kid in the egg? It's literally glued in there. What? Look, it was like glued in there. Why would they do that? Ew, dude, it's all like wrinkly and squished because it's plans on growing. Oh, it's all like filmy in there too. There's like a film all over the water. I mean, that's kind of cool though. Also very creepy, but I feel like kids would like that. Might as well destroy it. Yeah, might as well destroy it, but I say it's an enjoy, but I want to see what's inside that egg if it's the same dinosaur. So let's go destroy it. Okay, let's see what's inside this bad boy. Let's just do a little crack on the top. Oh, boo. <laughs> <laughs> That wasn't a little crack on the top. <laughs> the hammer was heavier than I thought it was gonna be. Look, but I didn't kill the little dude inside. What should we name him? I'll name him Mike. After Michael Badal. <laughs> By the way, are you new here? Are you following me on Instagram? Because I post like a picture a month and you got to see that picture when I post it. It's great. Go follow me on Instagram, at Matthias I am. Next product, Ninja Attack. Attack Ninja. Ninja gear, Ninja stars, one set. One set? Oh, there's like, oh, they're all different. How does this work? Signal reflector stars. What is that, a fidget spinner? Message capsule star. What does that even mean? More Ninja gear. Do you just chuck these at people? and then hope that they don't sue you? Your kid chucked that in my face! What is that? If you have problems. Guys, call that number if you got problems. Any any problem whatsoever, you know? Car broke down, 1-800-622-8339. Dang, you're gonna get, they're gonna get spammed, dude. <laughs> oh, these are foam. These are super foam. Me. Literally, I thought there was like some type of mechanism that allows you to like click it into something and spin it real fast, but it's literally just a throwing star. Yep, yep. This one, Brian, is designed to have a message inside of it. Here's my message. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> this is so tiny, I can't even destroy them. Hold on, I'm gonna destroy them for you. These are stupid. I call this one a destroy it. Let's see what happens when you... Oh, that worked out pretty well. Let's see what's inside. Literally nothing. Did you just squeak? <laughs> I did. Is it spinning? Uh. Now I got a spinner, dude. That's dope. Oh, what's up? I'm hip, mom. Oh, I was like, dude, we've tried this before and it almost destroyed our hearing. So I have to twist it slightly. Oh! Noisemaker, fart in a can. 100% stink free guaranteed. Do not use fart in a can to cover up actual farts. You're not fooling anyone, is what it says right there. Classic farts, silent but deadly, loud and proud. Okay, so at first I thought this was like actually like a can that has stuff in it, but there's a button on top and it's a speaker. Let's get inside this thing and see if it works. So put new batteries in it. Still doesn't work. Man, we've been getting some duds, dude. In this video, product's broken, they don't work. These are new batteries and everything, and I'm swapping them out, changing them. Man, I, that is uh, disappointing. You see that, guys? When a product doesn't work, you know what that means. Automatic, destroy it. Ooh. All right, fart can. Ah! What? It's undamaged. But no. I want to see what, just a, I'm just gonna drop the hammer. Literally just dropping. Does nothing. I thought it would do more. What? Sweet. What is this? This is weird. So we got fiber optic, color changing fiber optic light. So I assume we're gonna have to, oh, okay. Oh, 
So fiber optic, if you are interested, it allows light to travel through thin cables. So when we shine a light in here, what we should see is the light coming out of these cable ends, or I guess strand ends. Oh, you see that? How interesting. Isn't that cool? I mean, it's just, oh, it's changing too. If you put your face up to it, you really can't notice anything, which is interesting. Look at that. Ooh. As this light shines in there, you can see all the ends of the cables are shining that light. And it's giving us that nice variation of color here. As you can see, it shifts constantly. Very interesting, very interesting. Another way that uh, information is delivered, such as fiber optic internet, which is much, much faster. Fiber optic allows higher bandwidth than traditional cabling. Okay. Okay, I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> ah, funny stuff, no education. This is actually really cool. I say this is a cache. Although I wish it was much more powerful so that like in a higher lit environment, you'll be able to see it. Ooh, and it feels good too. Does it? Crush me, baby. Mm, fine, don't. Your loss. Before we get to the next couple of products, make sure you're subscribed here because if that button down there is red, that looks a little bit like this, that means you gotta click it to see more of these videos in the future. So click it and let's move on. Batman voice changer. Okay, so if you remember in the Walmart video before this, we had a Batman voice changer. This one's a little bit more old school, right? Does it work better? Because that last Batman voice changer, it was stinky poo poo. It doesn't even sound like English. <laughs> what? Sounds more like the Joker. <laughs> Hello. Hello. What the heck? How's that Batman? Yeah, what we gotta do is now find the microphone. Where is the microphone? Because you'd think it would be like this, right? No? Or are you talking to it like this? That's the question. Okay. Oh, yeah, see the microphone's right there. There's a little hole right there. This is a test. Where is he? Where is he? 10 out of 10, dude. 10 out of 10. Most realistic Batman voice I've ever experienced. Where is he? No, there's a little dial right here. So let's see if we can dial it to the correct one. Let's oh, try it. Like, we got another broken product, dude. <laughs> Let's try number one here. This is, um, does that sound like Batman to you? Sounds like he's- It doesn't sound like anything. This is a test. That sounds better. It is delay, which yeah. gives you that kind of like speech jammer yeah. thing. Have you ever guys, have you guys ever tried to do the speech jammer? Why do you want to kill me? Why do you want to kill me? Why? See, your voice kind of overpowers it. It's not loud enough. Exactly. There's no volume knob either. And that's the issue with all these speech changers is that like if, you know, at most at least give give like feedback so you can hear it yourself if no one else can even hear it. Here is number three. I am Batman. This is mini Batman. This is the last voice. This is Batman. This is literally just changing my voice and making it all one tone. You know what that means? Destroy it. Batman! Oh! oh! <laughs> oh Dave, Dave is rethinking his life choices now. <laughs> Wow, there's a lot of pieces in there. Ba you left the battery in. I did. I said, you want me to take the battery? You're like, no, it's fine. I don't think I said that. <laughs> oh, laser tag headgear. Wait, wait, what? Securely fits head. Eight to adult. What kind of adults you like? Yes! Besides me. That was it, right? Besides me though, no one, dude. Voice activated. So what? Shoot! Shoot! <laughs> pew, pew! <laughs> Hands free, three game modes, sound alerts, keep score. 
Well, this is busy. Okay, extreme action, hands-free, play, no guns. Street Runner Laser Tag is a new form of laser tag that does not require players to carry a gun. Voice activation. Voice commands activate the IR beam transmission. Just look in the direction and say fire. Fire! Fire! Oh, I shouldn't scream fire. Everybody's running out. My, my whole crew just runs out of the building. What? What? I thought it was like a whole headpiece. No, right there. Oh, I was like, I don't see anything. Okay, so this goes in like this. Like that. Threaded that. So now I put that part on my ear and I latch it to my head. So am I supposed to, am I supposed to like look through this thing? What is that? Here's the issue. <laughs> Before I even turn this on, I've already found a horrible issue with this product is when we're in close combat and I say fire and you're looking at me. <laughs> I literally make you fire your gun at me. <laughs> How does it know the difference between who's firing? Fire. Shoot. Shoot. Dude, I think I hit you. What? At when you said shoot. <laughs> fire. Yeah, I got you. Here, come here. Fire. Shoot. Pew pew. You got me. Okay, now now I'm gonna look this way and click and say fire. Oh, right. Okay. Fire. <laughs> what? You weren't even looking at me. Yeah, because it's infrared light. So infrared light bounces. It bounces a lot. What that means is that if I'm like looking at this, it'll bounce off that and hit him. And that's why your remote to your TV can work in the other room because it bounces all through the doors. It's just any sound that you make, it shoots it. It's not fire or shoot. It's yeah, it's just maybe like sound. Ready? Hey! Yeah, I got him. Hey, 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 hey. You're not even anywhere near me. And you weren't even looking at me. <laughs> I was like going this way, dude. Ah, uh, good stuff, guys, good stuff. That's a destroy it. Oh, that just got destroyed. Batteries again, dude! You're killing me! <laughs> He's trying to kill me, dude. That's it. See that thumbnail right there? It's an iPhone, but it's a stunner. It's literally a stun gun. No joke. It's pretty crazy. Click there. I'll see you over there. High five.